So in this last video, we're going to bring it all together and finally embed our Power BI content into our web app. So just to recap in terms of the previous videos, we've registered our application. We've spun up some a Power BI embedded dedicated capacity resource within Azure. We've assigned that premium capacity to our app workspace, which contains our content. And we have our Azure function that acts as our API in order to get that embed token. So now that we've done all that, the last piece is the actual front end. So on the blog, I've got a snippet of HTML code. So we'll just copy that into Visual Studio. And we'll save this file as index.html. So I'll just quickly walk through the code. Um, in terms of the two JavaScript dependencies we have on jQuery, uh, which is needed for the Power BI JavaScript library. Um, both of these are coming from um, CDNs, they're online hosted, so you don't need to download any more files, it's just purely the index.html file. Um, in terms of the HTML, it's we've just got a single div outside of our header, uh, or our heading I should say, with the ID of report container, which we refer to down in our JavaScript. And this is the snippet of JavaScript that's going to embed our report. Um, so the get embed token, we're going to need to update. This is the one update that you need to do to the HTML, which is for your Azure function URL for that get embed token API. But other than that, there will be an Ajax call to that URL. And the data is going to come back in the form of JSON. So um, this is when we start tapping into the JavaScript Power BI library. Um, and we bind the data that comes back from our JSON response from our um, Azure function URL in terms of stripping out that report ID, embed URL, and embed token, and feeding that to the Power BI JavaScript library and pointing that to our report container, which will end up embedding our report. So let's just do that final step of getting our function URL. Pasting that into Visual Studio. Save. And if we open the file, so I'll be making that Ajax call, we'll be getting an embed token. You can see that the Power BI content's loading. So that's it, it's fully interactive. We have the Power BI report. Um, but we're not on Power BI website, we're, it's just a local index.html file. Uh, if you wanted to take this demo further and go completely serverless, you could upload the index.html um, to some blob storage and make your blob container public and you'd be completely serverless in that scenario. You'd have your static HTML content and blob storage and your logic uh, for the get embed token within an Azure function. So that's it. Um, so yeah, if you've missed any videos, go back in the playlist. Otherwise, that's Power BI Embedded.